All right, Derek, you ready to get your bloop on? I've seen this hentai right. before. Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> I know enough hentai to see where this is going. That's I've your seen catchphrase, enough hentai to know where this is going. We've already, yes. we've already, we've already talked about your Derekisms. Was that one of them? No. Why is that not one of them? Because I haven't seen any hentai ever. Yeah, but you say that phrase a lot. That's not. That's just a meme. Yeah. You still say it a lot. I don't say it a lot. Well, you, you did in uh, season one, Speltons. Well, that might be because it's all the hentai. It wasn't all hentai, Derek. <laughs> yes, we played Octodad. <laughs> it wasn't all hentai, though. Jesus Christ. Um, I mean, I mean, I don't need to lie to, you, to myself. Oh, okay. Is, okay, I was, about to, I was about <laughs> to ask. I was about to ask. Are Goombellas like think? Are, are she like accurate with her like numbers? What do like you mean? what her ta her? Oh tattle. no no no! Uh, uh bloop, bloop. Yeah, off. you want the snack on these tentacles, don't you? You're darn blooping. Ew! No, I'd rather bloop. <laughs> oh, ow! He hit me. He wasn't. He didn't appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, no, her numbers are not accurate because all the health is modified. Um, you know, I'd rather bloop. Exactly. He does know that, and yet he. Ow. He's being a jerk and pretending like he doesn't know. Um, I guess I'll just start. I'll just start charging. That's the way to go. We'll have Goombella just fucking uh, get like. Ha uh, ha. Kame, 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 Kame. <laughs> oh boy. Let's get yeah, that's that. Yeah, that's probably how that goes. I don't know how that works. I don't watch Dragon Ball Z. I don't know either. I watched Dragon Ball Z in my uh, youth. I never watched my it. Youth. All right, um, it, it was nothing. It was never some. It wasn't something I ever got into. No, I never got into it either. Um, well, I did when I was young, but like I, I, I don't know. I, I do. I do have to say I like the fact that it's just um, it's just fucking uh, like it's just like one episode and then it's just like it, it's them doing one attack and then it's, talking the entire say, time. It's. It takes an entire episode to charge an attack. It takes another episode to unleash the attack, and it takes another episode to undo to undo all the, everything that that attack just did. Yeah. Uh, and then you're back to square one. Yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> the spooper has power plus P. That's uh, <laughs> that's a concern. <laughs> that means he does an extra damage of attack. What's the shy guy doing? <coughs> oh, he attacked the blooper for me. Okay. Um. Yeah, so this blooper, I think, was he? I think he normally has 10 or maybe 15 health. He has 25 12. here. He has 12? He has 12. Yeah. Um, yeah, he's more now. Alright, so flattened. we charge for a lot of times. Oh! We did 22! <laughs> well, that was a lot. Well, that was way easier with charge P. Well, yeah, you charged... We didn't even charged... use the power smash or power jump! You charged five times. I know. I don't know what you. I don't know what you expected. I honestly expected that to be a bit more annoying. I had. I had. He didn't even get to ink me. I got inked in my other time because he had so much health. Are you, are you disappointed? I. I have to say I'm a little disappointed. I wasn't inked. I. I Derek, I love ink. Like an Indian girl with some ink on her. No, I'm just kidding. I. Tattoos don't do say, much wait, for me. I was gonna say I didn't think you liked tattoos. I thought you thought tattoos were stupid. Yeah, sort of. I think they can look good, if you have like one or two. I don't know if you have your like your entire body inked. It's give or take. Oh, yeah. yeah. If you have your eyeball inked, I know somebody did that. Somebody got yeah, an I eyeball tattoo. I just yeah. I... <laughs> there are people who have gotten their eyes like dyed That's... to be just like you basically fill it like the all the white part. You basically like fill with black. Yeah, that. <laughs> oh, honey so, ultra. Like, um, you, and you a just point look swap. Like, so like. You know, you're basically at that or you can if you do that, you're basically just telling everybody, hey, don't hire me. Well, they I don't think they can discriminate based on that. OK, so here's the thing. Uh -huh. And this is something I I hate that people are get people get super defensive about. But in my in my or in my opinion, it makes perfect sense. Uh, it's not something that it's not something they should discriminate that, that they can discriminate about. However, frankly, if I'm going to, depending on the job, like if it's something that, Professor Frankly, like when you said that, if, <laughs> uh, if it's a job, awesome. it, so if someone's applying for a job where no customer or no person, no 
person outside the business will have to see them. If they're applying for a cubicle to work mm-hmm. in, for a job where they're just going to be working in a cubicle, sure. By all means, they can be te- they can look however the fuck they want. However, if they're going to be someone who's if like they're applying to Starbucks and they're going to be someone who's who's going to be like working a register or something like that, it's it's I like I can understand or like if I if I ha- if I own a small business and like I'm trying to hire a little bit of like, additional help and it's going to be someone running the register, I don't want someone who's going to look like who's going to like actually scare people away based yeah, because of their appearance i get that so like i hate when people are like or i i do hate the argument of like you shouldn't discriminate or i i've heard people with tattoos do uh, argue this a lot um mm-hmm. they argue that they shouldn't be discriminated against simply because they they oh, like like they they put they have tattoos or because like Star they piece. like they have marks on their body or something like that like if and the people who usually say that are people who have like tattoos on their face or something like that uh i don't care like it's a sa- it's kind of a sad thing but at the same time uh, or but it is a, a fact people are going to or like regardless of if whether or not people should like judge people or regardless of of the fact that people you shouldn't just like judge people by just by look based on their looks mm-hmm. people do yeah i know and so and i want like if i own the business i want to lose money simply because i hired because i hired someone who is going to scare away customers yeah or like i get that but also like think about it this way how cool would it be to have somebody with like fucking demon eyes working for you well if i'm work- okay so if i own a build a bear i don't think i want that i don't know dude that i i, I that's I, the kind of impression i would go- want to give if i had a build a bear <laughs> that the, that is possessed by a demon cult that's, that's see, where it's like- at Derek. see the, you know what? i think you're just running your business wrong that's what it is you need <laughs> i it's I'm not. It's not that I'm running my business wrong. It's that the clientele is just. <coughs> that's that's just how the clientele are. Here's the deal. You if, know. You know what's kind of interesting though. If you owned mm-hmm. a tattoo parlor, you would want someone who had uh, eyes for ink. Or yes, eyes and inked. tattoo parlors. I don't know. If, or anytime I, at least anytime I've ever seen a tattoo. Par- I've never actually been to a tattoo parlor. Anytime I've ever seen one in media, the people there are always have tattoos. Well, and that's I, because that's good advertising. That one, that's good advertising too. That like they're um, basically show they can show their they can show their work. It, that's actually the only main re- good reason is it's good advertising. It's it looks good to to the clientele because well, anyone honestly, going in, people going in there are, are going in there to get a tattoo. If they want and if they can walk in and see like this this person that works there with tattoos, even if they didn't do them their, themselves or if no one that works there did it. They still can see that these people have tattoos. It, it re- tattoos are something that people are generally very nervous about getting. Mm-hmm. Uh, it can reassure people just by seeing that. It can reassure people that like, yeah, I can get a tattoo. Like this, that guy got, has one. He looks like a normal human being, I suppose. Um, or like that chick has one, and she and like doesn't seem to it like doesn't seem to bother her at all. Like, it's a good it's good advertising. Ooh, that's t- tough situation here. Do I have a Nothing. Tattoos are a weird thing where, um, I don't think I think most people don't have a problem with tattoos as long as they can't as long as they can't see them normally. If you have a tattoo like on your shoulder, if you have a tattoo like on on like your waist or something like that, mm-hmm. like somewhere or like somewhere where people aren't generally going to see it, most people don't care because like as long as you can as long as you can cover it up, as long as people can't see it, that's fine. I've seen I've seen articles before where people are where it's like someone this is. I, I've seen an article before somewhere where it was like about people who have tattoos and like how they cover them for like work or whatever. Mm -hmm. Um, And it's like, you see like it's people who have like their entire bodies, like entire body tattooed, but you can't, but like as long as you can't see it, like it doesn't, most people, like if people don't know what's there, it's not going to bother anyone. Um, I've seen, I've seen pictures of people who like work at like Starbucks or something and like they show like their, um, they show them when they're there, like working, and then they show like just like their top, like their entire torso or something like that, and it's just completely covered. But like, yeah, that wouldn't bother if I walked in there. I didn't see, I don't see it. I, it doesn't bother what? me. Oh god, he has power rush the cunt. <laughs> Ugh. What? I'm like, why do you do more damage? He's fucking power rush. Also, I'm mad I couldn't nail a single super guard there because bullshit. Yeah. 
<coughs> yeah. Fucking die. Mm. Ah, god damn it. That's health drain. Ah. That's not useful. Okay. Go on. Yeah, uh, go on. Yeah. That's why I never... Er, I, I'm not opposed to the idea of getting a, getting a tattoo. It's something I'll likely never do. I do know two... There's two things I know that I would... Or there, If I were to, there are two things I would, would get, and one of them I'd be oh unsure of because... W emblem. <laughs> oh, perfect. We're already Wario. This is no Wah. longer Paper Mario. This is Paper bro Paper Wario. Wow. Uh, I would 100 percent the the one place I think I would never get a tattoo is mm -hmm. is my face. And that, that's one yeah. thing I don't understand is why people do that because like, th I feel like at that point you are literally asking people to like judge you, judge you at first appearance. I mean, whatever, whatever you feel like doing. I mean, I'm not saying I like. I, I mean, people can do whatever they want. I, it's just regardless of regardless of why they got a tattoo or why they or like why they chose whatever they they chose to have on their face. Putting mm. a mark on your putting a marking on your face is going to mm. tell. It's going to tell. It's going to tell people something about you at first glance, regardless of any tattoo regard you get will tell people about you, though. It'll tell people about you, but the thing is, is you can't always see. If you have a tattoo on your face, chances are people are going to see it as soon as they see you. If you have a tattoo on your shoulder, people aren't going to always see that. You could have something in covering. You could clothes generally cover your shoulder. Yeah, but on your I, I, a lot of other common places like on your arm or on a or on your foot, also like on the back, right above the. But, but that's a tramp stamp, um, mm -hmm. and no, you don't always see those ones. That depends on where you are. But I always notice the ones on the feet and on the hands too, uh, and they're really they're I really notice, not that bad. You notice it's not bad, and, it, and yes, people know some. All I'm saying is, of all places, your face is the place it, is that people I, will notice it the most. That would because because look, you, Derek, that depends often, on who you're talking to. All right, it depends I'm on just the, saying. I'm no. I, that's not the area I'm noticing first. <laughs> what I'm saying, <laughs> it's the, it's the part of your body that people cover up the least, and it's also the. Well, that <coughs> depends on the people too. It's also generally, it's also generally in conver or when having a conversation, it's generally the Damn, first that place life people. Would be nice. <laughs> I, I'm uh, upset. Oh, power plus P. Great. I, so happy. All right, go go on. Sorry, I keep interrupting you. My point, my my main point is just, uh, I'm not opposed to getting a tattoo. I there are two things I would get for a tattoo. First thing is the mark of the sea, which is from Final Fantasy 13. That's right. Which, I remember you telling. Uh, we actually talked about you getting a tattoo. I did. Yeah, I probably mentioned we this. We mentioned this point. early. Oh shit! Season one skeletons. I have <laughs> photos in my folder called Dirk's tattoo or Derek's tattoo. Um, because I was supposed to put it up in an Oh, episode. that's right. Yeah. Uh, yeah you got, it was a Fire Emblem tattoo. You were thinking, move, you were genuinely yes. thinking about getting it. That's all I remember. I don't think I was genuinely, because, like, that's something, first of all, tattoos are expensive. They cost money. I don't want, I don't have money. Yeah. Um, and that also, would be, like, to me, I, 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 I would find be, it a waste of money for myself. It, yeah. It'd be but, a heavy, it's also a heavy, I'm, or, one of them isn't as much of a commitment. The the mark the Final Fantasy one, the Mark of the Lucy. I really like Final Fantasy thirteen, thirteen too. People gar people will complain that they're gar or people will say that that everyone past seven is garbage. Or everyone will say people will say everyone every Final Fantasy Was past it eight? eleven. Past seven? Pa oh, past well, eleven. People okay. will say yeah. People will say past ten. I should say people mm -hmm. will say past ten. The starting with eleven are garbage. I don't know. I didn't play any of the ones. Well, before. I didn't, great. So uh, I didn't really play any before ten. Um. I, no, wait, really not 13. Main, like, Sorry, great. 15. 15's great. I played 15. I haven't I played thinking, 15 yet. I was thinking around. 15 is fantastic, dude. I think it's. I think it's a case where they change. Where we like should, they change the play style. If we ever do, uh, if we ever do um battle mode, we should really uh, we should do Final Fantasy 15. So we long. could both do it. I know. <laughs> I want. I want to do uh, Final Fantasy 15 for the show. Um. I, I just I don't want to begin it yet sale. because it'd be way too fucking long. But yeah, I would like to do it because it, it was a fun game. Maybe next yeah, year, perfect. like since this is probably airing 2018, next year, next year, 2019. The the other thing about that is though, I would like you probably on the couch for that instead of streaming. That's fair. Uh, cause, That's fair. You know, it's a great fucking game. I love it so much. 
Anyhow, it's the next time it's Belted Time, so we'll talk about right. Final Fantasy or whatever. Bye-bye. Yeah,